Martin Ferravari is a capital for the next couple seasons. This is absolutely fantastic news. Fantastic contract for him. Great value. We got him at three years for $2.675 million. Totally adequate value for what Ferravari is bringing. I wish we could have gone longer term, in fact, but we just don't have the money to do so, unfortunately. I would have loved to see like a seven times four, seven times five, maybe. I think he is going to be totally worth it. I think he is going to be a stud in the NHL for the next decade. I think he is going to be a constant on this Capitals blue line and a part of the Capitals core going forward. So far in his two full seasons with the Capitals, he has 17 points in 79 games, posting a plus 15. And then last season, 34, sorry, 16 points in 67 games with a minus 11. Again, the Capitals were quite terrible last season, so don't look into the plus minus too much. But this guy is an absolute force on the back end. He is big, he's beefy, he can hit, his defensive IQ is phenomenal. His chemistry with John Carlson has really made his transition to the NHL flawless. I love that the chemistry was just immediately there. He really bounces off of him well. The offensive output isn't quite there, although he has shown that he has shown flashes of a shot at times. He has eight goals and six goals in each of his seasons, so it's not terrible. The offensive capability is kind of there. I hope he can develop that more in the next couple of seasons. But overall, this deal is an absolute win. Double thumbs up. I cannot wait to see the player that he becomes, and I can't wait to see the player he is at the end of this contract. Um, I can totally see us giving him at the end of this contract a uh, six, seven-year big deal. I could potentially see him getting an A on his jersey in the future. I don't think Sandine is really going to have an A going forward, and we don't have any other young guys right now that look too promising. I think he's going to be the main guy on the back end for years to come, and I cannot wait to be alive and to witness all of that come to fruition.